So this is a um, very somber House of Rep. This is episode 10. This is going to be a very quick one because I just wanted to um, talk about the passing of a great legend, legendary actor by the name of Rishi Kapoor. He was a very, very, very cool Bollywood actor and um, sadly he's passed away from leukemia. So the news broke in the morning, so I've been taking time to just kind of gather my thoughts and thought I'd put it down you know, on the podcast, so he was a really great actor, I liked him a lot, my condolences go to the Kapoor family and everybody who basically is like reeling from this tragedy, um, it's sad because we've had like two losses, we had Irfan Khan who was a good actor and his passing and then now Rishi Kapoor, so two uh, really great actors have now are now not with us anymore so it's um it's bittersweet you know we're we're stuck in this COVID-19 thing I'm wishing everyone well and it's sad I really wish I could have worked with him he was a really great inspiration to me uh some of my favorite films of his were Amar Akbar Anthony that was a Mamoon Desai film it's one of my most favorite movies like it's it's a movie that I will always re-watch it's just great I just remember seeing it as a kid and he was brilliant in it as um Akbar and then uh, was he Amr I think um no no he was definitely Akbar in the film but uh the film is really good and he just um it's just a you know like a good masala film you know like it, it it's it's really nice like everyone's different characters their brothers that have been split from youth and then they come back together his you know portrayal you know the, the, he had he was a very multifaceted actor so he was able to like portray a really good range of emotions and also just the way his cadence was and the way he delivered dialogue and uh you know was working with people like his like on-screen chemistry with Neetu Singh who he ended up marrying and having two children with so one of them being Ranbir Kapoor who's like uh, the next generation of actors right now in the business he had a really good way of you know like portraying a sense of you know like energy and positivity in what he did so these were the things that kind of drew me and he was great at action he was great at like dancing scenes and you know like doing uh kind of playback uh singing and you know all the kind of stuff that you know bollywood actors need so he was very multifaceted very you know, like i saw like a jack of all trades and stuff and he, he also had you know like he, he took a stab at directing as well later on in his career when he started like not getting so many leading man and you know supporting roles he just moved into a kind of like the kind of uncle and father kind of character but he was very good in that too so I just feel that it's a it's a strong loss you know it's a it's a sad that we've lost this light on the world so he was a very 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 good actor another great highlight of his career for me is Naseeb he was amazing in that so Naseeb's another good um, Mamon Desai film ironically both of them are done by Mamon Han Desai so they're both amazing films and uh, they had a lot of scale and a lot of kind of like fun things you know a very rare film that passed that one crore territory kind of um you know box office kind of it was like a like a super hit back in the back in the day it's like an all-time earner movie so it was like you know it's kind of like one of those summer blockbusters for bollywood so it was really cool i mean the soundtrack the songs the the acting everybody basically in that film was on point so that's one of the Bollywood films that I always give like five shields. I'll do a separate review on Naseeb and Amar Akbar Anthony, but they already have very top scores and they're in my vault. They're just very good kind of timeless Bollywood films of that era and, you know, that kind of 80s uh, golden era of Bollywood. So a really good stuff. So, yeah, just um, I'm going to miss this guy really wish I could have worked with him so again condolences from the Rep Knights uh, we hope the Kapoor family um, we, we wish them you know uh, warm thoughts and condolences during this tragic time and um, you know he won't be forgotten he's uh, he's left a great legacy behind and hopefully in the future I can do the same and um, you know really you know hope he what he's looking down at us and and smiling that, you know, even though he's passed, he's 
he's he's found some peace so may he rest in peace very good actor and yeah that's really all i wanted to say on this episode of the house of rap so stay tuned for the next episode and rest in peace again uh goodbye uh rishi kapoor